got there? No, he didn't. No, sorry. <laughs> I was just joking, Phil. As a game of deception, uh, poker requires players to put on a performance. <laughs> that really was a misclick. Some are more believable than others. Vamos, pilas! Here are five for your consideration. So what do we make of Mikel Hab's acting skills at the Aussie Millions? He's slow rolling Sam! You could argue he played the role of antagonist to perfection. Ah, uh, sorry mate, that was uh, just the call. It's a race. Oh, okay. oh man. <laughs> so Dylan raised to 50,000 and Mikkel was, I guess, trying to call. Oh man, that's kind of a little dirty angle there, I think. He's like, oh no, I just meant to call. Mm. Oh no, Sam Abernathy, no! She's moved all in with sixes. Oh no! Oh no, has Mickle called yet? Oh my god, is he gonna really. Oh lord, oh no, fail fish! Oh my lord. Oh no, not like this! Oh my god, he's slow rolling Sam! Oh my lord, what in the world is going on? Oh my god, this, please, a six. Oh, I mean, I'm not, I don't usually root for players, but I mean, maybe he's truly thinking about this. You can see Sam is kind of disgusted here. Oh my God. I have never called for any kind of cards in any situation, but come on, six for justice. That's kind of a brutal slow roll there. I mean, <laughs> I mean, oh my God. We're gonna need a six here. Sam needs a six and only a six or she's gonna lose a huge percentage of her stack. 10. Sam needs to find a 6 and a 6 only here. Oh my god. Oh, 6 on the river! Ship it to mama! Oh my lord. Oh, 6 on the river. Oh my god. Ship it to mama. <laughs> wow. Some might call that karma, Mr. Hab. But hey, you might win this award. Here's a top acting tip. Less is more. Preston Nielsen delighted us with his quirky behavior at EPT Barcelona in 2013, but he could have taken it down a notch. Quick call from Nielsen. Heads up to the flop. And we got quads. Okay, that's a good flop. For Nielsen. Guri was the pre-flop aggressor. He continues with just ace high for 350,000. Firing stone dead. Oh, what is he doing? You don't like me? Telegraphing, I have a huge hand. How much? 350,000. Cool. At least he waited for the answer before putting the chips in. <laughs> Guri's got to be seeing this, right? Two of hearts on the turn. Obviously changes nothing. Guri slows down. He now checks. Wisely. It will be amazing if he just snap folds to a bet here. Nielsen does bet. How much does he bet? Well, he isn't insta-folding. Is he going to pay this off? Signs point to yes. Two and a half million in the middle with one card to come. The irrelevant ten of hearts. Really shouldn't be too much trouble Guri can get into here. He's just got ace queen high. He checks a second time. And Nielsen is going to go for value. 755,000. Oh, wow. I think without all Vince Vaughn's little baby games here, this is a fold. This isn't a wait six days and then call. This is a never call. He deserves a Razzie for this performance. Oh, my. Guri calls. Show him the quads. <laughs> Fire! Fire! 
4-1, mand, er det lækkert at krise. Still not sure how Big Toro managed to get paid off in that hand. He went on to finish third for 440,000 euros. Now, Daniel Negreanu has professional acting experience, having appeared in several movies. Not sure who wrote the script for this one, though. Ace King for Daniel Negreanu. Oh, apparently someone other than Steve Silverman is allowed to pick up a hand. Negreanu raises. Ow. And raises big. Oops. <laughs> 29, buddy. <laughs> Whoops. 45 even, not 29. 45? <laughs> <laughs> it's so nice. I meant to put in nine. I thought it's 29 for us too. <laughs> that is an 11x raise from Daniel. And an apparent misclick. Weird. How much, how much are you playing? 350, so about four. Oh man, this could get real ugly for Steve Silverman if he reads Daniel's sheepishness for weakness. He's got King Jack suited. He's got everyone at the table covered. Maybe he won't go too crazy though, because it's clear Daniel did want to raise in the first place. He just didn't want to raise that much. This spot is weirder than walking into a room where people have just been talking about you. All in. Solomon shoves! Whoops! And the Granu calls! Whoa! Did you get me? No, I have Ace King, but. He got you. Okay. This is the biggest pot of the tournament. <laughs> that really was a misclick. The misclick may have been genuine, but him feeling bad about it definitely isn't. Silverman drawing thin, looking for a jack or some clubs. Not too many clubs, though. negrano has got the ace of clubs in his hand. Just the right number of clubs. Well, it's mainly spades on the flop. 9-6-4. So far, so good for Negrano. Only three cards capable of saving Silverman. Finally got that one in. Hey! You have clubs, right? Oh, okay, I thought it was spades. All right. So now he needs a queener jack? Correct. He's running hard. Huh? It's dangerous. Ah, hey. He's very dangerous against this guy. <laughs> He's running through it, huh? The river is an ace. I got four, 38, five. Negranu doubles up. He wins a massive pot. Misclick, you say? You suspect, Negranu. You suspect. Well, the jury may be out on Negranu, but they have returned a unanimous verdict of guilty in our next case. This hand from EPT Madrid features the infamous Ivan Freites. Hey, Ray's. Ray's coming. Yeah. I'm sorry, call. What? Oh, oh, oh. I call. You said race. You announced race. I was no, speak English. You announced race. No speak English. No way he meant to just call with a full it's house. A that was not a mistake. Thomas Krems has been called to the table. I believe we're looking at an angle shoot here. Freitas knows the rule is that his raise must stand. Wow, did you see that? And I think he's trying to make it look like he didn't want to raise, so he'll get a call out of Eugene. I think this is exactly the same situation that we had already in this tournament. When you did exactly the same move that you had the nuts. I just shared this information with you. Okay? Wow, Freitas has got previous for this. You understand? So I force you to race now, and you have the option what you do. Twice the uh, unit to put in another 275. I think this is well handled by Thomas Kremser. He's forcing Freitas to min raise, but he's told Eugene Unite that this is a move that Freitas makes when he's got a monster. So, so what, because of what happened before. Oh, do you force him to win race? Yeah. Okay. It's not, it's not my option whether or not he raises, it's my option what to do now, right? That's yeah. what you're saying? Okay. Okay. okay, I understand. Armed with that information, does Eugene Unite now fold top pair? I know we're not supposed to actively root for players, but I sure hope he mucks. Make Freitas look like a chump. He makes the call. Freitas shows the full house. Same, same yeah. No, I know. I heard about this before the tournament started. So ugly, I can't tell you. Ugly? Move was so dirty, feel like I need a shower. I heard about this, so I heard about this guy a week ago. I heard about this guy a week ago. Okay. I've never seen Thomas Kremser look so disgusted. Speaking of disgusted, look at the other players at the table. Look at Juan Maceres. You know, back in the old days, running an angle shoot could get you actually shot. It could indeed. However, hashtag fun fact, Ivan went on to win the title and 1.5 million euros. 
Well, if you love ugliness and controversy, we've got a doozy from the big game. It's fair to say Tony G and Phil Helmuth didn't exactly see eye to eye on that show. Tony, can you, can you, can you please shut up? This hand is one of the reasons why. Phil Helmuth, Ace Jack. A lot of money out there already, and it's unopened. Real money. All right, I opened for the pot. pot. Pot's it. And you looked, right? Mm, well, I think I looked. Allegedly, I looked. Tony. I'm all in. Pot limit, brah. Without looking? Without looking. Pretty sure he looked. Well, you can't be all in. 66. Tony repots it with <laughs> Ace King. <laughs> all right, all right. He slowed down. <laughs> he slowed down a bit. Are you going to save the rest? Not if he believes you haven't looked. Helmuth now facing a raise and an angle shot. Oh, it's hard to believe that you always have a hand against me. Look, you, you, you could see the flop and get rid of it as well. Right? You could play good. Without looking too? I'm not looking. I haven't looked. I don't care. I know it's a random hand and I've got a random hand. Wow, all that talking makes me think he's strong. I was for sure going to call before that. 15 on top, Tony. He's saying he hasn't looked though. He most certainly looked. Did no one see him? He's he saying he didn't look. Yeah, you wouldn't lie, Tony, would you? I wouldn't lie. You can there check you my hand if you want. You, you can tell him the truth. You didn't look at either looked. card. I haven't looked. You promise? Ask Joe. Ask Joe. I mean, I haven't I looked. I can't say anything, but I'm not going to look. That's between you and Phil. He says he hasn't looked. He hasn't looked. I, I didn't Do see you believe it. him? Yeah. He said he hasn't looked. Only Joe looked. Did you look at your cards at all? I mean, it's... Look, the it, people at home, no, I haven't looked. Joe's well, looked at my hand. If you hand. haven't looked, it's kind of an easy decision for me here. We can run it ten times as well. Well, if you haven't looked, I guess I'll just move in. All right. Phil ships and Tony calls. <laughs> I did <laughs> All right, you're close. You're up there. How oh, you lied. You of course I lied. It's wow. poker, Phil. <laughs> what do you think this is? That's, yeah. that's messed up. So messed up. <laughs> wow. What do you think, I'm blind? How many times do you want to run well, it? Well, I asked you if you had looked or not. Do you want to run it how many times? I'll let you choose, Tony. Three, three times. times. I three always times. lose, so. You kind of deserve to lose the first I one. I do deserve. I hope you win one. Alas, dear viewer, Phil did not win one. Tony scooped all three runouts and sent the poker brat home. So which of our five nominees delivered the best performance? Who deserves the award for best actor? Cast your vote now at the PokerStars blog.